Design Limestone Putty Nano Generator To harvest energy from everyday motion to power small devices. Researchers at the University of Alabama in Huntsville, UAH have created a new kind of triboelectric nano generator tank that produces electricity through the use of limestone putty, promising considerable cost savings over conventional manufacturing methods invented in 2012. TENGs are small devices that convert mechanical or thermal energy into electricity for use in small, wireless autonomous devices like those in wearable electronics, condition monitoring and wireless sensor networks. Examples include heart monitor implants, biochip, transponders for farm animals or sensors that alert a driver. When tire pressure is low, Tangs harvest power for these devices by transferring an electric charge between two objects. When they contact or slide against one another, through motions such as walking, vibration, rotating tires, moving wind or flowing water, or with very little impact to the environment. Compared to existing tanks, which use expensive nanotechnology-based fabrication methods, the UAH Breakthrough is a new type of tank that employs tacky materials, like double-sided adhesive tape or limestone putty to generate a charge making it far more cost-effective and simpler to build. Traditional tanks require nanotechnology-based fabrication and other special equipment, points out Dr. Gang Wong, an associate professor of mechanical and aerospace engineering at UAH. A part of the University of Alabama system, only craft-level skill is needed to build our triboelectric energy harvester. The breakthrough is detailed in a paper published in the journal Axomega. Wang's co-authors at UAH include Dr. Moonyoung Jang, a postdoctoral research assistant, Sean P. Rabbit, an undergraduate research assistant, and Dr. Yu Lei, chair and an associate professor of chemical and materials engineering. The research is part of the Department of Defense DOD, Small Business Innovation Research SBIR program an initiative that supports government-funded contracts or grants that encourage domestic small businesses to engage in federal research and development projects. With the potential for commercialization, our industrial partner is Material Sciences, LLC. And Dr. Simon Chung is the project lead, Wong says. We have already filed a patent for the triboelectric energy harvesting design. Using adhesive layers, UAH's novel application of a limestone-based mounting putty, along with a metallized polyester sheet, also extends the operational frequency bandwidth compared to existing tanks. This is significant because some small energy harvesting applications, such as health monitoring and wearable exoskeleton systems, require a wider frequency bandwidth to collect the energy from human motion. Typical contact separation tangs operate at a frequency below 10 Hz, Wong notes. However, we are able to extend the bandwidth up to 80 Hz by introducing these triboelectric layers. In a vibration-based energy harvester design, after the successful demonstration of the tank, design using double-sided tape, we started to explore less tacky materials for easier separation of the materials. This is how we came up with the idea of using limestone-based putty. The UAH researchers envision future investigation of putty-based generators to explore the effectiveness of different minerals such as marble, sandstone and lunar soil.